Hello friends, welcome back to Call of the Wild. This time around we're doing a little bit of night hunting and Hirschbilden with the air rifle, as well as checking out some of the night vision gear from the high tech pack. I really like night hunting, but YouTube's compression doesn't really like dark video, so I've got my fingers crossed that this doesn't turn out too crappy once it gets uploaded. Let me know what you guys think and I hope you all enjoy the video. Well here's some fresh fallow deer droppings. That's a start. I'm not sure which direction it's going in though. Oh, that sounded like a roe deer. Okay, somewhere in this direction. Roe deer are pretty easy to call in, so pretty confident that I'll be able to get it to come close enough to me. Oh, there it is. A little guy. Yeah, come here, little fella. I'm using the air rifle which doesn't have a ton of range. So I do have to make sure that I'm fairly close. I'm pretty happy with my position here. Got a little bit of cover in this bush. So now I just have to be a little bit patient and see if I can get this guy to come a little bit closer. Here we go. Oh yeah, nice and close. Let's see, how about that? There we go, and he dropped. And that'll be the first kill of the night. Nice little silver roe deer. And that sounded like a fox. Okay, that's a warning call. That was quite close. So the thing about hunting small predators in this game, like the red fox and coyotes and whatnot, is that when you call them in, they tend to circle around you. So they usually don't come in from the same direction that you hear their initial call from. I've had them go all the way around and sneak up behind me before and scare the hell out of me. Now I'm not really sure how I feel about using these night vision goggles in the scope. Well, not goggles, but the night vision binoculars and the night vision scope from the high tech pack. Um, with the flashlight, because the flashlight automatically turns on and off when you switch to them. But I feel like that's a little, a little bit jarring for that transition. Normally when I do night hunting, I don't really use the flashlight um, because I try to take advantage of the night vision stuff. Uh, but I know that for YouTube, really dark video tends to look really crappy once YouTube does all the transcoding and whatnot. So for the sake of YouTube videos, I'm playing with the flashlight on right now. So we're going to have to see how this turns out. I'm not 100% confident that's going to look great, but I'm hoping it'll at least be passable because night hunting is pretty fun. Oh, oh, there he is. It's a, it's a level seven. That's pretty good. Okay. Now that I've got eyes on him. Yeah. Warning call. So he's aware of me. I wonder, uh, the wind might be going in that direction. I can't quite tell from the particles. Yeah, the wind's going that way, so you can probably smell me, actually. So let's spray some scent eliminator, and maybe that will help me out a little bit here. Um, hopefully I haven't lost him. Because I think a level 7 would at least be a gold. All right, I'm going to reposition and see if maybe we can find him again. 
There he is. Still going away from me, though. He's alert. Unfortunately, 140 meters is, I believe, going to be too far for me to get an accurate shot with the air rifle. So I'm really going to have to hope that I can get him within at least 100. Actually, you know what? Let's check. So the effective range of the ammo says 50 meters. Hmm. I feel like I can still take shots at up to 100, but I can't quite remember. It's been a while since I've used this rifle. Actually, I haven't really played with it since um, since I made the showcase video. Okay, he's coming back. Nervous. Yeah, the wind is definitely blowing in that direction, which is absolutely not ideal. But I'm really hoping that scent eliminator is going to help me out here. Because I need to get him a little bit closer. Okay, I don't know if you can see it clearly in the video, but he's right here. Behind these trees. Still coming closer. There we go, there's a spot. Of course, it's going to be no good if my line of sight is obstructed by these trees. But I think if he keeps walking in a straight line, once he gets over in this area, I'll have a clear shot. Oh no, is he running away? Oh no, he's moving. Nervous, nervous. Okay, he's very close. I can see him with the flashlight now. I don't think I'm going to get any better shot, so... Just going to take it. Looked like that dropped him right there. Nice. Alright, let's go get him. Alright, let's take a look at this guy. Nice. Solid gold. Yeah, pretty good. Got him right in the lung. Very happy with that. It's a good kill. Alright, let's see what else we can find now. Well, it's another male roe deer. I feel like these roe deer are quite active at night. Which is one of the reasons why I really like night hunting in Hirschfelden with the air rifle. It's still downwind for me, which I don't like, but I think the scent eliminator is still active. It lasts for 30 minutes um, in real time, and I don't think it's been half an hour yet, so I think I'm okay. Oh, is that him? Yeah, oh, that's a very small one. I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm happy to shoot him. But he's only trivial. So I'm actually not going to be too worried about scaring him off. He should walk right up to me. Oh, warning call, actually. Let's go prone. Looks like he might be a little stuck on the rocks or something over there. Kind of see him twitching. Okay, 72 meters. Okay, here we go. He's walking up. Let's get ready to take a shot when he gets closer. And stops moving so erratically. Oh, 
All right, you know what? Let's let's try a shot from here. Well, maybe maybe not. There we go. Well, I thought that would have dropped him instantly, but I certainly didn't make it too much further. Yeah, it's a very tiny little guy. Oh well. Still get a little bit of cash from it, so... Not too bad. Oh, there's the fox. Level 5 medium female. Too far away for me to call it in, and it's walking away from me. So I think I'm just going to let her go. I don't think that's worth pursuing. Okay, I think I very faintly heard a fallow deer. Like a little bit of a grunt. Very far away, though. I could also be imagining it. But I feel like I heard it. There we go. That's definitely what I was hearing. It's a warning call, so I'm going to be careful. Okay, it looks like he moved somewhere down here, unless there's two males in this general area. That was a mating call, which is a good sign. Just going to be a matter of finding where he is. Here's a run track for the fallow deer. So that means I must have scared it off at some point. So it probably got scared and ran in this direction. That's the last direction I got a call from. But he could very well have just been walking away from me and could have been out of range to call him back. Or if he's walking between need zones, he might just not even care and could just be, you know, going straight towards the need zone. Oh, he's very close. Been following his tracks for a little bit here. But that call sounded very, very close. Oh, there he is. Okay, that's a warning call. Oh, oh, he looks pretty good. Well, not like huge, but that might be a gold. Let's see, stop and... Okay, hopefully that was good enough. I should have at least gotten into the lungs. Okay, looks like he's definitely dead. I didn't see where he went down. Yeah, that was a vital hit. Oh, here he is? Yeah, it's not too far. Yeah, looks decent. He isn't huge. He's either big silver or a small gold. Yeah, silver. And, yeah. Not, like, really close to being gold, but, you know, pretty big for a silver. Oh, cool, I got the double lung with that. A little bit worried, but... You know, he went down pretty quickly. Okay, that's another fox call. I haven't seen or heard anything in quite a while, so I might just... pursue this fox. It sounded kind of far away, but luckily over here by the wind turbines, um, it's a lot of cleared fields so I've got quite a bit of line of sight oh yeah there she is it's another level 5 female but like I said it's been a while since I've come across anything tonight so might as well pursue her Alright, I've got to get to some cover, though. 
I'm thinking over here will be pretty good. Oh, I should actually be crouched too. Is that going to be a warning call? Yep. Okay, hopefully she doesn't run away. I'm going to be a little bit more careful now. It's really easy to scare the fox away. Okay, there she is. She's coming towards me. I do still want to get to some cover first. But she's kind of going to my right. And that's sort of going to obscure my line of sight. Because there's more trees over here. But let's see what we can do. There she is. Okay, as soon as she stops, I'm going to take a shot. There we go, nice and clean. That wasn't so bad. I could have messed that up. I could have scared her away, but... We got her. Yeah, only a silver, it is just a level 5. But there we go, there's some more money, and another good kill. Oh, another fox. Another female, too. Okay, that's quite close. I think she's just going to be just over this hill. And maybe around these trees here. Yeah, that's a warning call. Okay, so we go prone. Ooh, those sounded like a double warning call. She might be running away. But we might get lucky here, and she might still be hanging out. Ah. Oh. Sounds like a bunch of warning calls. Probably going to lose her. Oh wait, is that her right there? Uh, I don't think I'm going to have enough time to spot her, so... I mean, it might have been a different one. It was not quite the direction that I was expecting to see her from, or whatever it is. So it could have been a different fox. So let's see. Oh, that's a roe deer call too. Looks like we're starting to pick up a little bit more action here. Okay, yeah, another level 5 female. A little bit bigger than the last one, I think, but... Still not too bad. Let's see about this roe deer now. I'm not sure what direction that call came from, but I think it was somewhere over here. Oh, it's another trivial mail. That's a little disappointing. But again, it's not going to stop me from shooting him. Oh, that might be a little bit far. Let's see. Oh, no. Just the scope doesn't have a ton of magnification on it. That's not a great angle, but it should be good enough. Oh, I think I heard another fox. Oh, it's a male. Oh, here it is. It's kind of hiding. Yeah, just a silver. Oh, actually, silver from a trivial? Huh. I guess the trivial ones can get a little bit bigger. I think I hear footsteps coming from over here. Yeah, I definitely hear footsteps. Did he try to circle around me over here? 
Oh, yeah. Oh, that was really close. Oh, there he is. Okay, I don't know what difficulty he is, but I should be able to get a good shot. Oh, I think I messed that up. He moved. Ah. Oh. I think I completely missed. I think I really screwed that one up. I got a little excited there and took the shot, but it looked like he turned a little bit at the last second. And I think I shot right past him. I'm going to try to call him back in. Maybe I can get a second chance. I should have been a little bit more patient with that shot, but I was worried that he was going to get too close and run off. The good thing is that the air rifle is very quiet, so usually when animals run off from the sound, they don't go too far, and they're usually a little bit easier to call back in. Oh, here he is. He's coming back. Okay, he's only a level 5. So again, he's not that big. You can see him circling around. I hope he can't see me. All right, now he's coming straight in in the grass though so I can't really see him very well and let's try that all right looked like he just dropped should be pretty good here he is all right yep just another silver but I'm happy we got him back I was hoping he's a little bit bigger but not too bad well, that about wraps it up for the night. I hope you all enjoyed watching. Let me know what you guys think about the night vision and whether or not I should do more night hunting videos, as well as any other feedback or suggestions that you might have. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.